All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to One Game One Life. My name is Typo, and this is Cyberpunk 2077 Part 84. And we are about to do Judy's quest. It's about time that mission, quest, whatever, you know what I mean. It's about time we went and finally got around to doing this. She's been waiting on us for a couple of days, probably, actually, so it is about time we got to this. Let's go ahead and disassemble everything we don't need at the moment. Good, good. Any new jackets worth our time? No. 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 This probably looks so sick. God, I love those over jackets like that. They look so good to me, but it's just doesn't it can't keep up. No. Fun, but no. And again, we're holding on to that. Don't need that, and don't need that. Okay, and finally, no. Sorry, and finally, no. All right, should be good. Let's go ahead and hop out. We hit level 44 last time, so pretty wild. We're only about six levels away from capping out at 50. You're and we are nowhere near having our combat stats at 20, for example. Hey, V. You What's ready? up? This has been happening a lot lately. I even restarted my computer. I'm not sure what's happening anymore. It's just struggling out of nowhere. So glad you came. Molded over in my head, y'all were right. Sometimes the only rational course of action is a kick in the nuts and a bullet between the eyes. <laughs> you nervous, Tom? You nervous, Tom? How'd you know? First time you've done anything like this. Just imagine you're doing what a doll does. Just different program. You're great at that. How do I reach Hiromi? Any idea how I can get to Hiromi? Pulled the blueprint, got it all figured out. Okay, not all, but we're good on the penthouse. Best bets to access it from the service level. Got a way in from there. Okay. Remember to listen to your gut. Follow your impulses. Just remember, let the behavioral chip do what it wants. Got no time to deliberate and weigh decisions. Just follow your instincts. Freeze, tense up even for a second. Could cost you your life. Where's Maiko? Yeah, no pressure and there, by Michael, the way. where's she? Meeting with Hiromi to avoid raising any suspicions. Okay. She'll make him stay put until we're in. And we're going in right now? All right. We're going in. Let's do this. Hopefully once we get out of this spot, it'll stop doing this. Already feeling a little better in here. <laughs> Your taste, their pleasure, body dog. To maintenance. You two, head in right after us. Go straight to clouds. About fucking time. Yeah, sorry guys. I Stay didn't mean for this take to take so long. Might be lurking. I realized just now that it's staying at 5.06 p.m., so that is what it is there. Okay. Got a jack into the panel on the other side. Can you take him out? Yes. I'm not sure what saw me, so that's going to be hard to stay out of sight. I'm honestly pretty confused what did see me. Woo! That was close. Man, I almost blew this twice already. Imagine. Take a nap. Doing maintenance or whatever, I get it. I would kill you over it, I don't think. Not until I know better, at least. There it is. Alright. 
I'm getting out of sight. Judy? I'm the best at what I do. Maybe maybe not specifically the stealth bar, the spell part, but I'm pretty good at it. And as far as solo work goes, I am the best at what I do. Name another solo who can beat me. You can't. I mean, yeah, we didn't have to fight or anything. Took it out easy. Hello? Wow, really? What then? Everyone all in position? Tom and Roxy should already be at clouds. We go on Maiko's signal. They'll mop up security, you deal with Hiromi. Okay. But first, you gotta get into the penthouse. Not coming? Not coming with me? More likely not to be detected if you're alone. Okay. And besides, I'll be more useful here. If they activate any alarms, I can override. Nice. Can you get me in the penthouse? Get in breach security. Get me in the penthouse. Thought I could do it, but... Sorry, it's not gonna happen. Gotta manage on your own. Okay. On my way. On my way. Elevators on the other side. Be safe. To the roof, floor 55. We are soaring. The inside of clouds. Who's taking which floor? I'll take the lower level. Tom will head upstairs. We're all set. Yo, the fact that Judy made a chip program that's gonna let them take out Tiger Claws well enough to be able to take over all of clouds. If it works, that is actually something she could have made a fortune on that she's choosing not to. Respect. Yo, this keeps going, huh? All right, on the roof. Jump down onto the balcony. Careful, though, okay? You know it. Oh, hostile area. Okay. Good to know. Good to know. On my mark. Go. Why is there 468 eddies right there? I'll be late. What? I told you we have shit tons of work. Ow. I didn't expect the no, fall to do that much up. from that kind of height. I don't want any fucking dinner. Everything you cook tastes like sawdust anyway. Damn, brutal, dude. Love you Calm too. down. Someone's just trying to cook you dinner, bro. Chill. Chill out. Just not necessary. This is a nice looking penthouse area, I'm not gonna lie. A little jealous. Why doesn't my apartment have one of these, huh? The amount of eddies I'd pay for uh, an apartment like this? Substantial. And I'm good at making eddies, so I'd be able to afford it eventually, too. Find a way in. I've got it. Any cameras? Okay, a guy right there. They punched the alarm. Not if I got anything to say about it. Well, then he'll get what's coming to him at the bottom. <laughs> Easy. I mean, is it is it worth doing what you gotta do if you can't even live by yourself? You gotta have guards living in your place with you? Save a town, Night City Gangs, we already know that one. There you go. Take a nap in the fridge, apparently? They have an empty fridge? But why? Why do you have an empty fridge? You don't use your fridge? What? That's super strange. Okay, didn't expect that guy, I'll be honest. You really spray dances, we don't need that. Just a sound system, okay. There's no like real cameras in here. Bold? This go anywhere? Nope. 
All right. Let's head up then. Oh Jesus fuck! Floor's clear. I killed him. I killed them all. Damn. Same here. Go to the surveillance. They can't believe it. No. Security room. You do it today, or you forget. You forget about the whole thing. I don't care about any problems. The fact that their chat sometimes continues even when you've grabbed them is weird. Alright, that's where we're supposed to be going. Is this just more stairs, maybe? No, okay, we don't need to worry about that. Alright. Let's go in here, then. Yokai, Japanese demons of yesterday and today. We did read that one. Join the meeting. Here, finally. I was beginning to think you wouldn't make it. Right, wrong. Chicks will give you shit no matter what you do. <laughs> this one's a real charmer, too. There are they're all brain dancing? Damn. Don't like her either. Can we <laughs> oh, get this over with? That is not what I wanted Why to are say. Three guys? What's she playing at? That's, That's not what I wanted to target. say. Hiromisato. What are they watching? What are they watching? Demo reel of Cloud's next top doll. Specially selected by yours truly. A lucky girl's gonna replace Evelyn. Hope she proves smarter. Who are the other two? Who are the other two? Marcus Ishida Target and June Azagami. Hiromi answers to them directly. Now they're gonna watch him die in a pool of his own piss. This is not what we agreed. Look at me. See this? This is a look of unfucking surprise on my I know face. <laughs> Johnny. Death power is a question of strength, ruthlessness. This is the only way. Michael. I'm about to jack him out. They will not be chirpy after the rude awakening. One show ends, another begins. Just as good and unforgettable. Understand? This wasn't the plan. Michael, our plan made no allowance for witnesses. A show of force, we said. And any show requires an audience. I know how this needs to play out better than anyone. You gotta trust me. I thought this through many times. You're out to replace him. Meaning you want to replace her only. Mm-hmm. Even if that means joining the Tiger Claws. How the fuck else do you expect me to protect clouds from other gangs? I don't like this at all. I don't like this one bit. Too late for second thoughts. Tom and Roxy have done their part. Your little doll revolution is underway. Either we consolidate and win it all, or let everything go to waste. Do your thing. Well, she is no Parker. Wait. What's going on? Who is this? Living proof that Hiromi Sado's time is up. This merc has already disturbed the clientele at Clouds once. She murdered Oswald Forrest. And now she's invaded Mr. Sato's private residence. As if that were not enough, this is where Hiromi's sheer incompetence has led all of us to. What? What the hell? I have long looked upon Hiromi Sato's foolish, inept endeavors. But this? I think it's obvious he has outlived his usefulness. V, what the fuck's she doing? Clouds needs new management. Am I to understand that this future manager stands before me now, speaking with such zeal? With your permission. Over my dead body, we were gonna Stop get rid this. of her. Am I to understand these as your conditions? V, you gotta take him down. That's why we're here. Okay. Let's cut to the quick. Bored of all this chatter. I'd rather we just cut to the quick. I'll fuck you myself! I'm God doing what Judy wants. Time for a blood! Hey, what the hell were you thinking? Time for the time for a blood bit! Sumatagi. Sumatogi, sorry. Things are going to go as we planned. 
Or at least the way Judy wants. And at the end of the day, that's really what I'm here for. I'm here for Judy. I don't give a shit about clouds. I, I honestly don't. I'm here because Judy wanted me to be here. I'm helping a friend. And what you wanted isn't what she wanted. What? What might that be? They'll have their revenge. You've turned clouds into a ticking time bomb. You tried to cheat us all. Tried to pull a fast one on everybody, didn't ya? Jumped aboard the Liberation Train, pretending you wanted to help. But all you wanted was to take Hiromi's place. Bravo, but you missed just one detail. I still can, and no one can stop me. Not their corpses, not yours. Really? <coughs> That's your play, Maiko? That's your play. <coughs> Maiko. All right, V, get out of there. Exits on the lower level of the apartment. Then find the elevator. I wish I could ask Judy whether she wanted me to kill her or not. Well, this guy needs to die, though, for sure. These guys are dead. Good. Remember this. You're nothing on us. Nobody is. Not 1v1. Tom and Roxy are outside and safe. They weren't followed. Alright. Get down to street level. Waiting by the food stalls. Sounds good. Oh, whoa. 840. Uh, that's kind of fair, I think. Should have seen that coming. Probably About three hours, start to finish. The start. Same sec we walked into her office. Jesus, am I a gunk. Clouds is free, that's what's important. Who cares what she was scheming? We did it. That's what matters. Clouds belongs to the dolls now. You're right. That was the plan all along. And you made it happen. Thank you. Oh. See you later, V. Oh, damn. See you around, Judy. We'll see you later for sure. Thanks again. You're welcome. Job complete. Okay. We're not going to the bazaar. Don't go when I go. Sending the clowns is right here, so I mean... Oh my god. That's actually pretty far down. I almost jumped that. Even though it looks like there's glass that would have prevented it, but still scary. With how much damage we took from that other fall that I didn't think was going to hurt, that could have been sketchy. Oh, Judy. Almost hit you there. Jesus Christ. What is happening? All right, I've got to, there's got to be something because this wasn't happening the whole game. It wasn't. Ooh, the music. Oh. Honk? How do I honk? We're so in the way right now. That's fine. Oh. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> he actually looks like a clown. Hey, you're V, yes? He sounds like ghouls from Fallout. You didn't answer my question. Yeah, that's me. Yeah, that's me. Good. Then let's go. Where to? Little China. I have a craving for Kung Pao chicken. Extra spicy. I'm the look. He's fine. He probably is in pain, but he's fine. You're not gonna kill somebody running into them at five miles per hour. Doesn't that bother you? What? The grenade. You know, the one in your face? Uh, you get used to it. I just gotta be careful not to pull the pin when I wanna pick my nose. He has a grenade for a nose that still has the pin in it. What? 
Yeah, I know he loves this rock, though. Come on. How could you not? Nice out here. Excuse me? The, the light was red, dude. What are you, me? You can't just blow red lights like that. You know, down in South. I know where Brazil is. You never know with you gringos. With you gringos. Okay. Okay. This is where the game started. This is how we get the Vix. Heard of them? Who hasn't? Got any friends in there? No, why? Just asking. Can't help being curious. This is the place. Wait for me here and keep the engine running. We came all this way to get takeout? You could say that. Yeah, he's gonna kill somebody. We're just the getaway driver. Fairly positive. I can't actually change our camera right now. What are you doing, boy? That's the place next to Misty's. Grenades up your ass, too? told me what you were planning from the get-go. <laughs> it's true what they say. You're good. Really fucking good. Got a stick up your ass, though. This is where we part ways. Good luck, V. And, uh, relax a bit. Okay? <laughs> How did you get the grenade? Now tell me. Are you gonna tell me about the grenade? Oh, that. My brother ripped it off during a fight. With pliers. Unhappy family. <laughs> you don't know the half of it. I could have chipped another one, but I don't know. I think this matches my style more. Uh huh. Besides, it's a real icebreaker with the ladies. Got me powder for my nose. <laughs> and does it work? <laughs> Not really. <laughs> what about my payment? What about my payment? This guy's wild. What about it? Here, like I said before, the best don't come cheap. Take care, V. And hey, keep your nose to the ground. Johnny loves it. This guy's massive also. Look at the size of this man. Johnny, you got nothing for me? Nothing to say? Nothing to contribute here? Okay. Okay. So, that, so that's a thing that happened. Interesting. That was really quick, too. Whoa. The Cyber Psycho sighting's back. What is this? An Adelamain, too. Oh, yeah, let's go do that. I'm just glad the Cyber Psycho sighting's back. I thought maybe we missed it. Can I switch camera? Thank you. Nice. Made the turn. Alright, we got some distance to make up, but we can go do the Cyber Psycho, do the Delamain. All shouldn't be too bad, man. Uh-oh. 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 Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Woo! Woo! Yep, I saw that coming. Sorry. My bad. But my car is not dented. It's not the end of the world. <laughs> Talking about selfish. <laughs> oh, damn. For all the good we're gonna do in this world before we leave it as V, we sure do do a lot of minor bad things. V, a vehicle of mine went dark near your position. Right. Fine. Keep an eye out. For unknown reasons, the coordinates came through corrupted, so I'm unable to determine the precise location. Fair enough. 
I don't want to watch it. Alright, here we are. Hey, Maelstrom's got a cyber cycle problem. As usual, I'm only interested in a problem that's under control, but alive. And be careful. Maelstromers are crazy, psychosis are not. Police drones just spotted some weird symbols on the ground, surrounded by tons of blood. Well, I guess it's one of Maelstrom's sick-ass rituals. Sick-ass. Oh. Hey, Johnny, you joining us for this one? Yeah. Right. Look at all the dead Maelstromers. Isn't that exciting? A freezer. Finely chopped human limbs and entrails are the contents. Oh, well, that's just wonderful. Isn't that wonderful? What this guy's still alive, fuck? though. You okay? Lilith has concealed the death circle from the ancestor's eyes. The hell is this? What the hell did you just tell me? Got a bad feeling, V. Johnny's got a bad feeling. I mean, Johnny's got a bad feeling. Huh? Maelstrom Cultist Shard, an encrypted shard. It's time. E95551C. 55, Read the shard found on the dead Maelstromer. Okay, it's not gonna show up. Interesting. I don't think this is the one. Jose, grab the boys. I know who tipped Padre off that the cops were headed for Twister. Just give me the name. I'll take care of the rest. Maria Costa. Be careful, though. She's a cop. I'll be fine. It's time. Everything's ready. The circle is drawn. The lamb awaits the slaughter. Come as soon as you can. We can't wait anymore. My silicon craves blood. Cables are crackling. Links are sparking. Modems are groaning so loud I can't think. The Abyss is impatient. The Abyss is hungry. This is some full-on cult stuff, isn't it? This guy's got messed up, too. Oh my... What? Wait, this is actually crazy. Yeah, those are human parts, all right. Yo, wait a second. Grimy. Jesus, that's you, Johnny. Dude, I'm on edge. I'm actually on edge. That was spooky. Oh, I'm like, this out. This is really cool. Where'd she go? She was there, and then pff, over here, and then pff, gone again. I'm afraid I'm gonna turn a corner and she's gonna be right there. Did you hear that? In my right ear? I'm blocking. Search the area for information. Dude, I keep hearing stuff, like breathing in my ears. If you're wearing a headset, I'm sure you know what I'm talking about. What is this? Johnny, do you see anything, bro? Anything that could help me? Hmm. What, the entrails? Whoa, what? And now she's in here? Neutralize the threat. Got like blade legs? You alright? Pretty sure she's about to attack me, isn't she? Yo, she just disappears on you. Best defense is good offense. Got her staggering, got her flying around, punching her. Alright, I don't want to kill her though. 
There. She's alive? Good. Yo, this was really cool. The hard reset approaches. The hard reset approaches. Yo, that was sick, actually. The whole, like, that to that thing was crazy. What was that? That was almost supernatural. The boys have prepared everything and found me a lamb. Blood will course through the fiber optics, swirling and blending with the digital, opening the gates of the abyss. Death within arm's reach, the metallic taste of his scythe on my tongue. I will tug at the tangled cables of fate. A hard reset, a blue screen, a brain reformatted. I'm ready. Luck be with me. So she hard reset herself? Yo, what? You wanna run that one by me again? Something about this ritual went wrong, seriously wrong. The place is covered in guts and blood. Must have had something to do with uploading the brain into the net and straddling the border between life and death. Only the girl who jacked in couldn't handle it. She went psycho and started tearing into her tombs. I thought women were more resistant to cyberpsychosis. Anyway, at least we have her alive. Is that a th what? Women are more resistant? Really? It's true, women are less likely to get cyberpsychosis. All the better we have her alive for more research. I thought nothing could surprise me anymore. Boy, was I wrong. Wonder what she heard through those cables, what caused her to crack. I'll keep looking into it. In the meantime, I'm sending you your cut. Bonus included. Property developer tossed in token of their gratitude for freeing up the building that Maelstrom was squatting in. Not bad, eh? Looks like this was supposed to be some trip to the other side, in a tub filled with ice and the blood of innocence. Maelstrom never ceases to amaze and disgust. Techno ne Techno necromancers, without a doubt. <laughs> oh no, dude, that's crazy. That was really cool. The bloody ritual. More of that, please. That was sick. Alright, let's go find this Delamain cab and then uh, I'll head down to the city center race because it is nighttime. It's time for a race. Pretty sure I was supposed to show up at nighttime for that. Alright, Delamain, where you at? Oh. Find the hidden Delamain cat. Yeah, got it. Thought for a second it was implying I had found it. Whoops, I hit camera instead of map. Are we going the right way? Interesting. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I can't be bothered with you guys right now. I probably should have take, taken him out. But we're running out of time. I want to make sure we get to the city center race before it's too late. Get this Delamain thing taken care of real quick and then make it there. I think this is our fifth out of seven Delamain things. Okay, so it's in here. Wrong in the head or what? Is that it? That's it. Wow. Forced me out of the way. Easy. Easy. Here to help. Not one step closer. Where are you going, bro? Anakin. Hey. Bro, you're gonna hit a pedestrian, dude. Go down. Leave me be. Says the girl who's hit like two or three pedestrians at a time, but not on purpose. Follow the Delamain cab until it stops, huh? That's an interesting one. What, is he gonna run out of gas? Get tired? We could be doing this all night. It's unfortunate. Alright, Delamain baby, where are we going? These things are like offshoots of Delamain, basically. Okay, I don't know what these buildings are used for. Storage facilities that are just empty, I guess? Now you're just swerving back and forth with no real rhyme or reason. What are you doing? That's where we came from, bro. Where are you 
you headed? Well, there you have it. <laughs> what? Okay. I've managed to reestablish contact with the vehicle. That's weird. Shock therapy works wonders sometimes. <laughs> I'm sending a tow truck and a share of your fee. Yet only one of those is going to your credit account. Ha ha ha. Ha ha ha. Thanks, Delamain. Yeah, it's five out of seven. All right. Well, that was interesting. All right. I'm going to go ahead and make it to the city center race. I'll... We'll pick that up later. It's kind of out of the way, isn't it? We'll make it to the city center race before it's too late. So I'll go ahead and make that drive off off stream. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, consider giving it a like. If you really enjoyed it, consider subscribing. I think that bloody ritual, I mean the the Judy mission was cool enough for what it was. It was alright. There was a bit of a twist in there with Maiko and all that, but it was okay. The bloody ritual, that was cool. The fact that it had me spooked and kind of like goosebumps on my arms. <laughs> I want more of that. That's that was really awesome. But yeah, I'll see all of you next time. Thank you so much for watching, and V and I will see you next time.